Yo, what up this planet? I know the, the, the fade didn't even all the way come in. But anyways, y'all, save this video so I can do a happy Thanksgiving now. Thanksgiving for me and my family is like a big deal for the simple fact that, you know, a lot of my family is in Florida. And that's on my dad and mom's side. And then, you know, the rest of my dad's family, which I just slapped the mic, is in like uh, Northern California or like Middle California, Southern California, however you say it. But we're the, we're the southernmost point of California. So down here in San Diego, I'm the southernmost point of California. So anything other than San Diego is like, you know, up north. I'd be like, yo, I'm going to L.A., yo, up north. Like, <laughs> even though it's Southern California still, it just makes sense for me to say up north. But anyways... Happy Thanksgiving. Whatever you're doing with your family, make sure, you know, it's memorable. Make sure you just, it doesn't even have to be something crazy. Like, you ain't got to shit yourself in the pool. I'm just saying, like, you know, it, it is what it is. It's all worth it is. I don't know who that was that came and laid the straight wood on DeMarco Murray. But, uh, okay, we get the ball back. And you already know Mark Ingram, my favorite running back. No, that's not a fumble. Just keep that, keep that in mind. It's not a fumble. But, yeah, man, like. Thanksgiving is just big. Like, what the family that we do have close, we kind of stay close knit. Kind of go by everybody's house. You already know. And even my brothers, like, even my my brothers, like my blood brothers, and then I have my brothers that are just brothers. Like, I can't even say like I don't even call them like the homie or whatever. I just say it's my brother. Like, <laughs> I don't know why. You know, I, I I stay close to a lot of my friends. Like, I'm not one of those people who are like every year my circle gets smaller. I don't go through that shit at all. As Anthony Barr brings that heat. <laughs> <laughs> As he brings that heat, he brings that heat again, round two, and he he brings the heat again. I'm I'm, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. I'm not gonna have you sit there and you know wonder if he does. But yeah, round three, fight. Um, yeah, man. Like I'm not one of those people who have like my circle gets smaller. Like you see all those memes and all that bullshit. Like it seems like every time I get older, I see all kind of snakes. It's because you had bullshit friends in the beginning. And they're going to continue to be bullshit friends. They were bullshit friends at the beginning. You just didn't take your time to, you know, realize that. Like, my friends that I've had, I've had them. Man, I have 20 people that I, you know, associate with on a high level. And those are friends. And then I have five people. I have five people who I consider as, like, brothers outside of my actual, you know, blood. And that's just what it is. Like, me and my circle gets bigger like as years go on like I, I gather new friends and all this like as the, the time goes on the years go on I don't have that problem dealing with fake people because I sniffed that out in the beginning the people who do have problems dealing with fake people are the people who can't figure out who's fake and who's not and what the fuck is he doing um yeah man so that, that's just that's just me and that's why my Thanksgivings are always memorable and what the bitches you crazy you gonna throw this shit straight at me but uh yeah, man, my things are always memorable because I go over a lot of my friends' houses, a lot of my brothers' houses, and, you know, just, <laughs> it is what it is. And this is going to be my first Thanksgiving, actually being single, and it's going to be kind of weird. <laughs> I don't know, it's going to be kind of weird because usually I go to a friend's house, family's house, and then I go to my girl's house, but that changed, so not a big deal. And I'm about to hit them with the woo-wop right there. I should have went to the house. They should Everybody else on the field should have failed, my team included. Let me go ahead and get to the house real time. But, um... Uh, yeah, man, like, you know, um, Thanksgiving is a big deal. I, it's a big deal for a lot of people. You think about it. <laughs> I don't know. I just kept running. Usually I would hit a little move, but I was like, fuck it. If he hits me, he hits me. Apparently he didn't hit me, so, hey, he didn't want this. He didn't want that heat. But um, Troy Palomalo, you got to be a man to tackle Mark Ingram. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I know I know that you like waiting for the big run to just come out of nowhere. You wait for that big play. And I know this is a big play right here, but, you know, you already know Mark Ingram's going to get his yards now. The first game we played, he had 172. The next game he played, uh, he had 124. Somebody got to catch the goddamn ball. But uh, he had 124. This is the third game, and we're going to find out. Actually... I'll let y'all do the calculating. We're going to find out how many yards he has on the season so far. On the season so far. I'm trying to keep track. He runs a fake punt and completes that bitch. Ain't that about a bit? But anyway. Yeah, man. Like, holidays, especially towards the end of the year. The end of the year is, like, the best couple holidays all put together. You get Halloween as Lewis Delmas, who is probably the best safety, that free safety that I have played with in Mutt now. I play with that... Uh, I haven't had great three safety, so 
I played with Rashad Jones. He he just didn't he just didn't dive on the ball enough. He just didn't get to the ball enough. As uh, Rashad Jennings, my the fan favorite, gets out there and makes some uh, makes some noise. But uh, he has four rushes for sixty five yards, and and you already know Mark Ingram's gonna get yards as we go ahead and start galloping down the field. You already know one was gonna break. He's gonna one that patience that the speed he has is just fine enough for me to go ahead, you know, and just have patience with him, even if I'm spamming the the turbo button. The turbo. As Dominique Rogers come out and make another pick, bitch, give me that. But anyway, so just make sure it's memorable, man. Like especially at the end of the year, you got uh, Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas all coming up, and New Year's. And hey, man, just enjoy yourself. Don't worry about YouTube. Fuck what a YouTube nigga think. <laughs> Why'd I say that?